Artists in Rich Zambia is a book by Anna Ziambo. The artist works at a desk in Luseka district. She writes poetry and stories for eight hours a day. Her working hours are devoted to creative writing. She writes poems and prose for 160 hours a month. Her monthly salary is 1,200 Zambian kwacha. Poets are self-employed workers in the creative economy. Professional poets labor in the knowledge industry. The Republic of Zambia recognizes that poets are productive workers in the arts sector. Poems are cultural artifacts that contain artistic knowledge of Zambian heritage. Poets provide evidence about the status of the human condition in post-colonial Zambia. Poetry reveals what African people are capable of articulating. Listening to Zambian poetry is an opportunity to hear the ideas that African artists can express. Reading poems is a chance to study the vocabulary available to Zambian writers. What can African people achieve with creative writing? Poetry is a demonstration of capabilities. She is capable of describing ideas with words. She exhibits her capabilities through creative writing. The poems in her oeuvre are written descriptions of knowledge. She describes the contents of her intellect and in poetry. Expressing knowledge with written language is a valuable skill in the domestic economy of Zambia. There is demand for creative writing. The people of Zambia read poetry. Audiences in Africa listen attentively to knowledgeable artists. Zambian poetry is popular on social media. She self-publishes poems on the internet. Her poetry products are digital economic artifacts. Readers and listeners deposit money to her e-money number. Today, she earned 20 Zambian kwacha from a reader in Kalikiliki who appreciates the poems on her blog. The poet earns money. The artist creates wealth in Zambia. Artists in Rich Zambia is a book of creative nonfiction by Anna Ziambo. I am Anna Ziambo, writer in the Republic of Zambia. This artwork was made in Luseka District by Anna Ziambo for Anna Ziambo Publications.